Hello and welcome to this Cloud Academy course on VPC VPNs and IPsec. Before we start, I'd like to introduce myself. My name is Jeremy Cook. I'm one of the trainers here at Cloud Academy, specializing in AWS. Feel free to connect with either myself or the team here at Cloud Academy regarding anything about this course. You can email us at support at cloudacademy.com. Alternatively, our online community forum is available for your feedback. In this training course, you'll be introduced to IPsec and how and where it's used within VPCs to create site-to-site -site redundant VPN tunnels. This course will provide you with a background of the IPsec protocol suite and includes a fully functional demonstration of both building statically and dynamically routed IPsec VPN tunnels between two VPCs. The agenda for this course is as follows. We'll review general IPsec networking and security concepts providing an explanation of what it is and why it's useful. We'll describe in detail the individual parts of the IPsec protocol suite, authentication headers, encapsulating security payloads, security associations, Ike phase one and phase two, and both transport mode and tunnel mode. We'll review use cases and scenarios where IPsec would be useful. We'll review limitations, highlighting issues to watch out for. We'll examine where and how AWS uses and implements IPsec, introducing you to the VPC components, virtual private gateway, customer gateway, and VPN connection. Finally, we'll conclude our course with two VPC IPsec demonstrations. In the first demonstration, we'll create a statically routed IPsec VPN between two VPCs. In the second demonstration, we'll create a dynamically routed IPsec VPN between two VPCs. This demonstration will include BGP, used to perform root advertisements, allowing us to propagate routes and dynamically update VPC route tables. The following prerequisites will be helpful for this course. An understanding of Open Systems Interconnection Model Ethernet TCP IP TCP Dump and Wireshark General Networking Concepts such as routing and gateways Finally, to build your own VPC Jumbo Frame enabled environment, you'll need an active AWS account. If you require an introduction to VPCs and associated networking concepts, then please consider taking the VPC related courses here on Cloud Academy.